Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I have got two Kylie Cosmetics boxes here. I am so excited about these. Like, I have had these for weeks. I have not opened them because I had my highlighters. I was waiting on my velvet. And now I ordered the blushes and those are going to have to be a separate video because I cannot wait one more day to open these boxes. Oh, okay, no, these are the velvet lip kits that I got. She came out with a new formula. I just love like her little notes in here. I think they're so cute. We're going velvet. Hope you love this new formula, XOXO Kylie. And that's so cute with like little bow. And I got three new lip kits, Charm, Rosie, and Harmony. Those are the three colors. And we are for sure going to be trying those on. Do not worry. But we're going to open up the highlighters. So I ordered French Vanilla, which I believe is the lightest shade. And I also ordered... Strawberry Shortcake, which is like a rose goldy color, and Salted Caramel. Let's take a look at the highlighters first. I am so excited for these. First of all, these feel really heavy. I've also seen a little bit of controversy about these on the internet because some people are receiving theirs and they're empty, so I'm really hoping that's not the case with mine. Ah! Oh, what was that? Oh, the little plastic thing. Oh, that's like really heavy duty, but it has a mirror in it and it's got the little peel off. Ah, when you open a new mirror. They don't really smell like anything. That's what French vanilla looks like. We'll swatch these in a set, guys. First, I'm just gonna open them all. I'm gonna make sure there's product in all of them. I honestly like don't know if I, I don't know like why people would receive empty pans, but there's strawberry shortcake. And then we have salted caramel, which I love these names that they're like all sweets <laughs> sounding. And salted caramel. Alright, so let's swatch a roux. These puppies. So the first one here is called French Vanilla, and I think this is the lightest and least pigmented, but still really pretty. It's just a softer highlighter that Kylie made. Um, it is the lightest one, so I think it's going to be really good for fair skin tones. It has kind of that gold shimmer that you can see, but it is probably, it was the hardest to swatch, and so I think that it has kind of the least amount of like opacity to it. So um, then we have... Strawberry Shortcake, which is a really pretty rose gold, and that's the one that I'm going to put on for you guys here in a second. I absolutely love this color. I think it's gorgeous. It's highly pigmented. It's really shimmery and shiny, and these are so smooth and blendable. They aren't patchy. They aren't streaky. They aren't um, really harsh. They're just really light and airy and just perfect for a highlighter. They aren't chunky at all. Then we have Salted Caramel, which I also think is gorgeous. This would be perfect on medium skin tones. Um, I think in the summer, I'll be wearing this one a lot. It's got that kind of bronzy finish that I think is absolutely go gorgeous. It's like that inner golden glow that you want all summer and I think that I will be using that one all summer long. Alright, so now we'll take a look at the lip kit. So I have Charm, Rosie, and Harmony and Charm is probably the one I'm like most excited about. I thought it looked like a really pretty pinky nude, kind of maybe like a darker version of Candy K, which you guys know is like my all-time favorite. Oh, it's pretty light. Let's see. And I like the lip kits. I like, oh, that's a really pretty color though. Do you guys see that? Mm, I love that color. Ooh, ooh, I love the way that that like feels and it doesn't like dry down. We're going to try, we're going to try them on. I think I'm just going to put one on, but we're going to try it on. Don't worry. Rosie, these ones are like, they're smaller, I think, than the other ones. Maybe not. Oh my gosh, they really are like velvet. That's Rosie. They're so pigmented like completely opaque just like the lip kits which is awesome i love that and then the last one we have is harmony which looks to be like a brighter pink oh it's not it's really just like a medium pink i don't really like that color that much i think some people really like it with my skin tone something like that pink kind of looks weird i love charm though we're gonna put that one on so let's try it on really quick i'm gonna take off what i'm currently wearing it is one of the nars velvet matte lipsticks in bahama let's try on charm I'm going to do the lip liner and the lipstick. It's funny that they're not matte, you know? They just, because they're, ooh, I want to do that. Ah, oh, that was really satisfying. I'm going to take these off my hand because they don't dry down, and I'm scared I'm going to touch something and get that color everywhere. All right, let's try on charm. So we'll do the lip liner first. See, it's the same consistency. Yeah. Really creamy really pigmented. Do you see that? Oh, I love this color. And for some reason, like, I was, like, really in 
to matte liquid lipsticks for a long time and I'm really into not like I haven't tried this formula but like the normal lipstick or actually I'm really into glosses right now which is kind of weird because I've never in my life like been into glosses but I am so this is charm and let's just try it I'm, try I'm interested to try this applicator because it's like really oh it feels good on the lips it's just funny on your hand it's like stiff oh no you get really good control with it oh it's like the perfect shape interesting things could always be worse I remind myself of this often when I'm coughing when I'm sick when I'm hurt I get my ass out of bed meditate the crime out my head there was no time to pretend this life I came to end so I should enjoy the time I have I implore my best in them when I feel lost when I feel down I know it's all cost to pay for another but I actually really like that. I think it'll be really, really pretty when I have a tan. So let's just kind of let that sit for a second and try some highlighters. So what do I want to try? I only want to really put one of these on. I think either Salted Caramel. I kind of have, I have a highlight on already. Or Strawberry Shortcake. I think Strawberry Shortcake is going to go the best with my look today. So let's do that one. All right, we're going to use this like really big fan brush because... Why not? It's really fun and I just got it. So I'm just gonna get a lot in there. And you guys can already see I'm wearing highlight. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't okay, I'm not gonna put any more on there. Do you guys see that though? How insane that glow got? Oh my nose, it's a little pearl. Oh my gosh. Bam! Oh my gosh, that's insane. So, these are insane. This is insanely comfortable, this formula. It is, it's thin. So, it kind of reminds me of liquid lipsticks that she does already, the matte ones. But, it's, so it doesn't feel like, it's not a thick, moussey texture like the plush mattes. Which, wasn't necessarily what I was hoping for. But, I feel like those feel like they really adhere to your lips. And so these definitely are going to maybe slip inside a little bit. It's not bleeding or anything weird, um, but you want to be really careful when applying it and kind of like eating and touching it up. I obviously haven't tested out like the staying power of these. They aren't supposed to be super long wearing. They are, I can't stop looking at my highlight <laughs> in the mirror. It's just like, whoa, 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 whoa. Honestly, like I feel like Jacqueline Hill. I'm just like, whoa, glowing from space today. Okay, I really, really like that, but I'm going to finish up on the liquid lipsticks. I don't know if um, they'll bleed. I haven't worn them. I will test them out and come back and let you guys know in the future. But from right now, like I think they're very opaque. They're super pigmented. The wand is smaller than the normal wand, and so it gives you a little bit more control. And I love that because they aren't going to dry down matte, so you want to make, obviously, like less mistakes. They're going to be harder to clean up. Um, the one I don't like the most is probably Rosie. I don't know. I might take that home with me when I'm traveling and give it to one of my sisters if they like it because I don't really think I'll wear that very often but I do really like this one and I think it'll be a really pretty everyday summer color um so yeah I'm really really excited about those I'm really excited about the highlighters they are super finely milled and they're not glittery they're just like shimmery and gorgeous I have cotton candy cream which I know is Kylie's favorite and I know I knew that was gonna be my favorite too so that should be coming soon and I'll be getting her blushes um, if you guys don't want to see Kylie cosmetics reviewed please let me know I know that a lot of people do these kinds of videos but part of the reason that I do them you guys is because I don't care what anybody says I like Kylie Jenner I'm a Kylie Jenner fan and I am a big fan of her makeup I think she's done a really good job with it. I think her line is really good. That's why I continue to order it. I'm always excited for her to come out with new products because I truly believe that they're going to be really good quality. And that's why I order them and why I test them for you guys. And I would purchase all of these again, maybe with the exception of Rosie, but I think I, er, with Harmony, sorry, not Rosie. I've been saying the wrong one. Harmony is the one that I am not sure about. This is the one I'm going to take home and maybe give to my sister Kate. But I'm going to try it on and just see like what I think of it. I can't wait for my next order to get here to see the pigment of the blushes um, and how they blend because they do look really bright and so I'm really curious if they blend like nicely on the face or if they're kind of like too pigmented almost. So that review will be coming for you guys soon. Um, let me know if there's anything specific that you want me to review, that you want me to test out, anything new that's come out. I want to make content that you guys want to see and that you're interested in so let me know in the comments. I love you guys. Thanks for watching. Give this video a thumbs up and I will see you guys all in the next one. Bye.